Stephen, 3 0 win here over Livingston. What were your thoughts on the game and the performance? I thought the performance, especially first half, was terrific. You know, usually we um, we set off teams a little bit and play on the counter, but when you're playing against Livingston, you've got to face a lot of longer balls and balls into areas that hurt you. They're very dangerous, good side. Um, and, and by the way, they deserve a heck of a lot of credit, both sides, for being where they are at this stage of the season. But I thought our tempo and our energy and also our quality you know, was, was excellent in the first half. How pleased were you with that fast start the team made to the game? Yeah, and we, we spoke about it. You know, the, the Dundee United game was still in our minds. We all talked about starting well, but nobody really took the, the game by the scruff of the neck. But today we did, each, each and every person on the pitch and the boys that came on. Um, we won our headers, we won our tackles, we done the basics and you know, we showed a lot of quality. People override us as, as a team that just has energy and well organised. We're, we're a good side and we've got good players and I thought we showed that today. Mark Ahara scores two, that takes his total to ten for the season. Tony Watt got his first goal today as well. How pleasing was that? Yeah, look, Mark's he's so reliable. He's been fantastic all season and you know to get him tied down to a new contract shows uh, you know what we're trying to do. Tony Tony gives us that little bit of quality, you know, I thought his goal, great composure. Um, he's getting fitter, he can be fitter. Um, He'll be, be probably listening to this as well, so yeah, you can get a fitter, but he was fantastic for us today. You know, when when he's on so he's hard to play against. The two boys up front were a right handful. Um, and then we bring Grievo on in the, the second half after we've a lot of boys with long journeys and you know, we had a little bit of illness in the camp as well throughout the last ten days. So um to, to produce a performance like that and have the options available on the bench, which we, we haven't done for numerous weeks, um, was was fantastic for us today. Yeah, that performance as well coming off the back of a lot of noise coming into the game about how big a game this was yeah look I, I played it down to the players because pressure is when you can't pay your mortgage pressure is you know when when you're going into a game and you don't think you're quite good enough or you're not prepared we're super prepared we've got a group of boys that give absolutely everything and we're a very talented side so we went in with a lot of confidence like we'll go to Tyne Castle and we'll go to Ibrox um, with confidence because it's one result of three points and we mustn't get too carried away Yeah, How important is that that you stress that to the boys that are still three games to go and you still got to pick up points? Yeah they know that look, nobody gets too carried away here when we lose games we don't listen to the noise and when we win games you, you remember what you're good at you remember why you've won games and we'll reiterate that again next week we'll give the boys that have been away a little bit more recovery and, and We'll be ready for Tank Castle. Yeah, and again, we mention it every time we're here, but the fans play a massive part today. Yeah, it was you know, really, really good. The first half, like the atmosphere. And then it's difficult when you're 3-0 up. You know, we, we made a lot of changes. We took Mark off from from what happened previously with the same referee. It's um, It was a decision just to take him off and not put any risk to ourselves. Um, and then you see the game out, and it was important we got a clean sheet. I have to give a special mention, the back three were fantastic. You know, people see the result, but I thought Joe Shaughnessy was, was outstanding, my player of the match today, and he hasn't played loads of games, but the way he conducts himself and the way he trains every day um, allows him to put performances like that on. So it's absolutely vital that young players look at him and, and see what an attitude does for you. Stephen, well done today. Cheers, thank you.